What's up guys, this is iTweaks here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to change your Cydia icon from that old iOS 6 style to a new flat iOS 7 style. Now there's going to be one tweak that you're going to need, and that's iFile. So if you don't have iFile, make sure you download that from Cydia. Now once you have iFile installed, then we can go ahead and start to install the new Cydia icon. Now there's going to be a few different Cydia icons to choose from. And I'm going to put a link in the description below for you guys to click on, and it's going to bring you to this Reddit thread. And there's a bunch of different uh, icons right here that you can choose from. Just tap on them, and it's going to show you the icon. The one I'm going to use here is the final hack one right here. So it's the sixth one down, and we're going to open it up, and then there is the icon right there. So if we tap and hold, we're going to save the image. That way it's stuck in our camera roll. So now what we want to do is open up iFile. And let's go all the way back to the very beginning, okay? And this is where you're going to start. So you're going to scroll all the way down here to VAR, and then open up VAR. And then we're going to scroll down here to Mobile, open that up, tap on Media, and then DCIM. And then if there are multiple folders right here, you want to tap on the last one. So we're going to tap on this one since this is the only folder. We're going to scroll all the way down to the very bottom because this is where our icon should have saved. Now to check it, we're just going to tap on it tap on image viewer and that's the icon that we saved so what we want to do now is hit the edit button right here and then we're going to select this and then hit the little clipboard right there so we can copy the link alright so now we have that on our clipboard so now we're gonna go all the way back to the very beginning alright so now we want to tap on var again and then we want to scroll all the way down here to stash tap on stash and then tap on applications and then we're going to scroll down to Cydia.app. This is the this is the folder that we want to be in. So we're going to open that up, and then we're going to tap Edit, and then we're going to paste it right there. So now our icon is in this folder. So if we scroll down here, we're going to look for it. It should start with IMG. All right, so that's it right there. It should be the only thing in this folder that starts with IMG. Now we're going to look for the icon at 2x.png. This is what we want to get rid of. So what we're going to do is tap edit, and then we're going to delete this icon. But before we do that, let's go ahead and tap on the arrow right here. And then we want to double tap right here, and we want to select all and copy this. That way we don't have to type it in for the second time. Because what we're going to do is rename that icon that we just put in the folder to icon at 2x.png. All right, so now that we have that copied, let's go ahead and tap out of it. And now we're going to delete this icon just by hitting the trash after we've highlighted it right there. So move the file to trash. And then we're going to tap on this one. Go ahead and open that up. And now we want to rename it to the exact same thing that we just deleted. So it should be icon at 2x.png. All right, so now we're good to go. So now what we want to do is either respring your device or reboot it. So let's go back. So this is what your Cydia icon is going to look like before we reboot. Now let's reboot. All right, so now that we've rebooted, once we unlock our device, you'll see that that Cydia icon is completely different. It has that new iOS 7 look to it. So let me go ahead and zoom in right here so you guys can see that that is the brand new Cydia icon. So let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. If you have any questions or are having difficulty doing this, go ahead and ask your question in the comments below and I'll try to help you guys out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, go over there and stop by and say hey. All right, guys. Until next time. Peace.